Listening section. In this section of the test, you will have the chance to show how well you understand spoken English. There are four parts to this section, with special directions for each part. Part one: Pictures. Questions one to four. Directions: For each item, there is a picture in your test book, and four short statements about it on the tape. They are spoken twice and are not written out on your test book, so you must listen carefully. You must choose one statement: A, B, C, or D. That best describes the picture. Then, on your answer sheet, mark your choice. Example: Look at the picture and listen to the four sentences. A. They're looking out the window. B. They're having a meeting. C. They're eating in the restaurant. D, they're moving the furniture. Choice B, they're having a meeting, best describes what is seen in the picture. Therefore, you should mark B on your answer sheet. Now, let's begin part one with question number one. Number one, look at picture number one on the test paper. A, the woman is singing a song. B, they are standing by the piano. C, the girl is playing outside. D, the girl is having a music lesson. Number one, look at picture number one on the test paper. A. The woman is singing a song. B, they are standing by the piano. C, the girl is playing outside. D, the girl is having a music lesson. Number two, look at the picture number two on the test paper. A, the ship is under repair. B, it's raining hard in the city. C, the skyscrapers are over the harbor. D, the sailor is checking the rope. Number two, look at the picture number two on the test paper. A. The ship is under repair. B, it's raining hard in the city. C, the skyscrapers are over the harbor. D, the sailor is checking the rope. Number three, look at picture number three on the test paper. A, they are holding their handbags. B, one of them is wearing gloves. C, both have long curly hair. D, only one of them is wearing a veil. Number three, look at picture number three on the test paper. A, they are holding their handbags. B, one of them is wearing gloves. C, both have long curly hair. D, only one of them is wearing a veil.
Part 2. Questions, Responses. Questions 4 to 6. Directions. In this part of the test, you will hear questions spoken in English, followed by three responses also spoken in English. The questions and responses will be spoken only twice. They will not be printed in your test book, so you must listen carefully to understand what the speakers say. You have to choose the best response to each question. Now listen to the sample question. You will hear, Could you work until 9 tonight? You will also hear, A. No, it doesn't work. B. Yes, you can go to work now. C. No, I have to be home by 8. Choice C. No, I have to be home by 8 is the best response to the question, Could you work until 9 tonight? Therefore, you should mark C on your answer sheet. Number four. Do you think the boss will take us out for lunch today? A. I had a hamburger and fries. B. He is probably too busy today. C. I didn't take the bus. Number four. Do you think the boss will take us out for lunch today? A. I had a hamburger and fries. B. He is probably too busy today. C. I didn't take the bus. Number 5. How about catching a movie after work? A. Thanks, but I can't tonight. B. We are moving the day after tomorrow. C. Yes, the movies were great. Number 5. How about catching a movie after work? A. Thanks, but I can't tonight. B. We are moving the day after tomorrow. C. Yes, the movies were great. Number 6. Do you know where the meeting will be? A. Yes, it's in Jane's office. B. I know him quite well. C. This afternoon. Number 6. Do you know where the meeting will be? A. Yes, it's in Jane's office. B. I know him quite well. C. This afternoon. Part 3. Short Conversation. Questions 7 to 10. Directions. In this part of the test, you will hear several short conversations twice. The conversation will not be printed in your test book, so you must listen carefully to understand what the speakers say. In your test book, you will read a question about each conversation. The question will be followed by four answers. You have to choose the best answer to each question and mark it on your answer sheet. Example, you will hear The driver will meet you at the gate. What kind of car will he be driving? He'll be driving a large black limousine. You will read What will the woman do? A. Look for a specific automobile. 
B. Wait at the door. C. Drive a car. D. Call a taxi. Choice A. Look for a specific automobile is the best answer to the question, what will the woman do? Therefore, you should mark A on your answer sheet. Let's begin with the following conversation. Number seven. What is your ordinary day like? Well, I always get up at five and work with my laptop until 7 a.m. I drive to my office at 8 and get back home at 6 in the evening. Number 7 What is your ordinary day like? Well, I always get up at 5 and work with my laptop until 7 a.m. I drive to my office at 8 and get back home at 6 in the evening. Number 8 Could I see the menu, please? We have tenderloin steak, sweet and sour shrimp, baked salmon, and fruit salad. Our salmon is fresh from the ocean, sir. I'm a vegetarian, so I'll take the latter. Number 8 Could I see the menu, please? We have tenderloin steak, sweet and sour shrimp, baked salmon, and fruit salad. Our salmon is fresh from the ocean, sir. I'm a vegetarian, so I'll take the latter. Number 9 Can you join the three of us for dinner? Thank you, I will. Is 6.30 alright? I'm in a meeting until 6. Let's make it 7. Number 9 Can you join the three of us for dinner? Thank you, I will. Is 6.30 alright? I'm in a meeting until 6. Let's make it seven. Number 10. Where were you? I called you several times last night, but you didn't answer. At eight? Oh, I did my report for two hours and went to bed after that. Number 10. Where were you? I called you several times last night, but you didn't answer. At eight? Oh, I did my report for two hours and went to bed after that. Part four. Questions 11 to 15. Directions. In this part of the test, you will hear several short talks. Each will be spoken twice. They will not be printed in your test book, so you must listen carefully to understand and remember what is said. In your test book, you will read two or more questions about each short talk. Each question will be followed by four answers. You have to choose the best answer to each question and mark it on your answer sheet. Questions number 11 and 12 are based on the following procedure text. The conference organizers would like to remind attendees that identification tags must be worn at all times in order to gain entry to the lecture halls. The presentations will be starting shortly, but before that, there are a couple of other procedures to make. Firstly, I would like to remind all conference guests to read the presentation timetable, which includes the names of all the presenters. 
Secondly, I have to ask all guests to ensure their mobile telephones are on silent mode, so as not to disturb any presentations. All right, that's enough of me. I'll hand you over to your first presenter. The conference organizers would like to remind attendees that identification tags must be worn at all times in order to gain entry to the lecture halls. The presentations will be starting shortly, but before that, there are a couple of other procedures to make. Firstly, I would like to remind all conference guests to read the presentation timetable, which includes the names of all the presenters. Secondly, I have to ask all guests to ensure their mobile telephones are on silent mode, so as not to disturb any presentations. All right, that's enough of me. I'll hand you over to your first presenter. Now read question 11 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 11 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 12 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 12 in your test book and answer it. Questions number 13 to 15 are based on the following announcement. Attention all passengers waiting for the 355 bus to Jakarta. We have just been informed that due to the roadwork to Bantar Bridge, the service to Jakarta has been cancelled. For the ticket holders who wish to continue to Jakarta today, we are arranging the shuttle bus to take you as far as Tugu train station where you may continue the journey by rail. We apologize for any inconvenience and hope you will continue to choose speedy bus lines for your travel. Thank you. Questions number 13 to 15 are based on the following announcement. Attention all passengers waiting for the 355 bus to Jakarta. We have just been informed that due to the roadwork to Bantar Bridge, the service to Jakarta has been cancelled. For the ticket holders who wish to continue to Jakarta today, we are arranging the shuttle bus to take you as far as Tugu train station where you may continue the journey by rail. We apologize for any inconvenience and hope you will continue to choose speedy bus lines for your travel. Thank you. Now read question 13 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 13 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 14 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 14 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 15 in your test book and answer it. Now read question 15 in your test book and answer it. This is the end of the listening section.